Have you ever heard of the world's smallest cetacean that's on the brink of extinction? Imagine a tiny porpoise, the vaquita, no larger than a human child, with a body sleek and grey, eyes lined with a captivating mascara-like pattern. A creature that calls the northern Gulf of California its home. This little marvel of nature is unique, the smallest of its kind, yet it holds a giant symbol of our planet's rich biodiversity. But tragically, this tiny creature, the vaquita, is a symbol of our planet's biodiversity, yet it is teetering on the edge of extinction. The vaquita's home is unique, just like it. Nestled in the northern Gulf of California, this habitat is a bustling marine metropolis. It's a place where warm currents meet cold, creating a rich mix of nutrients that supports a kaleidoscope of life. The vaquita, though small, is an integral part of this biodiversity. Its presence indicates the health of this vibrant ecosystem. But just like the vaquita, this crucial habitat is under pressure. The vaquita's home, the gulf, is a vibrant ecosystem that's under threat. Why is the vaquita, this small and unique creature, facing extinction? Well, the primary threat to this petite porpoise is bycatch in fishing nets. That's right, these porpoises often get unintentionally trapped in nets, meant to catch shrimp and other fish. This accidental capture has greatly contributed to their dwindling numbers. With fewer than 10 individuals remaining, the situation is deeply urgent. The vaquita's story is a stark reminder of the impact of human activities on wildlife. The vaquita's future hangs in the balance, and it's up to us to tip the scales. The vaquita, the world's smallest cetacean, is teetering on the brink of extinction, with fewer than 10 individuals remaining. Its survival depends on us and our dedication to conservation. By reducing bycatch, protecting the vaquita's habitat, and supporting conservation organizations, each of us can play a role in saving this unique creature. Time is running out for the vaquita, but together we can make a difference. The fate of the world's smallest cetacean is in our hands.